Welcome to the module describing the Gigamon private cloud solutions used to access traffic in virtual environments using GigaView VM. In this module, you will learn how the Gigamon private cloud solutions provides ready access into a variety of virtual environments. At the end of this module, you will be able to explain how GigaView VM supports traffic visibility after virtualization, describe specific support capabilities for VMware ESXi, Describe additional support for VMware NSX and the software-defined data center. Explain support for virtualization within a Cisco application-centric infrastructure. Illustrate the way in which GigaView VM provides traffic access in OpenStack or KVM environment when your VMs are present as a tenant. Detail the simplified deployment, management, and configuration of GigaView VM. The Gigamon Data in Motion Visibility Platform portfolio of hardware and software options provide pervasive visibility across physical and virtual networks, remote sites, and future SDN NFV production networks, all accessible through the GigaView FM configuration and management platform. For improved tool performance, GigaSmart technology features provide for stateful and packet level optimization and normalization functions. This module describes GigaView VM and GigaView V-Series nodes, features for visibility into virtualized workload. With the trend toward virtualization and cloud use accelerating, there are at least five areas where the impact of virtualization is a concern. Security is no longer an afterthought during virtualization. There is rapidly increasing mission-critical workload density. Visibility into VM-to-VM -VM traffic is required for both performance monitoring and security. Replicating the physical tool inventory with virtual instances of tools has a serious impact on workload performance. And, once local tools and monitoring are configured within a hypervisor, that effort has to be reconfigured along with each workload server migration. Rather than creating a separate tool deployment and profile for each hypervisor, instead, link traffic from that hypervisor and workload into the existing security and monitoring profiles through a traffic access profile and then use the existing rules and profiles without special efforts to accommodate for virtualization. GigaView VM is able to support both ESXi and NSX VMware hypervisors, monitor workload for multiple vCenters and hundreds of GigaView VMs on different hypervisors, with automatic traffic policy migration when vMotion events take place. Support for Cisco's application-centric infrastructure is provided in several ways. Endpoint traffic flowing between leaf and spine switches is VXLAN encapsulated, so VXLAN decapsulation is available from the visibility platform to optimize tool access to that traffic. By filtering for certain VXLANs or inner header elements, it is easy to select specific virtual tenant traffic for delivery to monitoring and security tools. The inter-switch communications are available for both monitoring and troubleshooting purposes too. Support is available for virtual networks where you are a tenant and do not have any rights or access into the infrastructure. Traffic to and from your guest virtual machines can be made available through the visibility platform even when you only have administrative access into your own workload. Taking advantage of lower cost cloud resources does not mean that you have to give up visibility into east-west virtual traffic, as you can still select and deliver traffic to your existing monitoring and security environment through the visibility platform. The GigaView VM virtual node is a native virtual machine that extends pervasive visibility for monitoring, analysis, and security tools into VMware. This first section will describe support for VMware ESXi. Fabric Manager learns the virtual ESXi environment by inventorying the vCenters it will be working with. Referencing that inventory of hypervisors and installed workload, Fabric Manager is quickly provisioned to deploy GigaView VM as a guest OS on each hypervisor where virtual traffic is sought. Through a simplified user interface, various traffic access policies are created by selecting Guest Workload from a list and then identifying which traffic is required. Fabric Manager pushes policies out to the appropriate GigaView VM instance. Abiding by the traffic policy, GigaView VM selects traffic from inside the hypervisor and forwards out to a physical GigaView node, where that traffic is made available to all interested monitoring and security tools. As a workload is virtualized, visibility into that virtual environment is accomplished by placing a GigaView VM node as a guest OS operating system on each hypervisor. In this way, traffic which has been virtualized, hybrid traffic, or traditional physical traffic can all utilize the same monitoring and security profiles and tools. The GigaView VM footprint is as small as possible so that monitoring access does not steal the very CPU cycles and other hypervisor resources that going virtual was intended to maximize. 
By transporting packets out to the physical environment, all of the other advantages of a visibility platform become available too, including all of the traffic intelligence packet optimization choices. GigaView VM has overcome the serious and difficult problem of maintaining a viable traffic monitoring profile in the face of vMotion. When vMotion initiates a move, the workload is copied from one hypervisor to the next. Close integration with vCenter allows Fabric Manager to learn about the impending move and act automatically to migrate the monitoring profile to follow the workload. This allows tools to receive a continuous stream of traffic as the workload is removed from the old hypervisor and activated on the new hypervisor. This is all handled automatically in the background and without any user intervention. GigaView VM supports the VMware Standard Switch, Distributed Switch, and the Cisco 1000V Switch. Integration with vCenter ensures that any vMotion event is accommodated automatically in the background. Through Fabric Manager, which acts as the console for all GigaView VM actions, you can deploy and manage hundreds of nodes operating within multiple vCenter environments. Fabric Manager offers various choices for simplified workflow configuration for traffic monitoring policies. Dashboard tables and graphs show top and bottom in virtual nodes, virtual ports, and virtual maps. Selecting one presents a quick view graph of traffic for intervals from one hour to one month. Building on existing ESXi support, GigaView VM also supports VMware NSX in a similar manner, but with added features unique to software-defined data center automation through NSX Manager. VMware NSX offers ESXi-like functionality as a base feature set. Accordingly, GigaView VM provides virtual traffic access to NSX in the same manner as it does for ESXi. NSX goes on to provide new functionality for multi-tenant environments. Tenant-level visibility in this multi-tenant environment is available through GigaView VM today. It also means that the latest in virtual networking solutions can be deployed while still maintaining high levels of visibility for monitoring and security. VMware's NSX reproduces the entire network model in software, enabling network topologies to be created and provisioned in seconds. It enables a library of logical networking elements and services, such as logical switches, routers, firewalls, load balancers, VPN, and workload security. Users can create isolated virtual networks through custom combinations of these capabilities. Working closely together, Gigamon and VMware engineered custom features that permit automatic provisioning of traffic visibility as part of the network topology provisioning facilitated through NSX. Leveraging the Gigamon API and the dynamic service insertion features within NSX, you can spin up or tear down new topologies through NSX Manager. This means that underlayer or virtual traffic can be optimized to meet tool needs with features like filtering on a specific tenant's traffic, or by using VXLAN header stripping, or even generating NetFlow for selected traffic for a particular tenant as part of the automated provisioning. Dynamic service insertion works like this. Fabric Manager registers itself as a service in the NSX Manager. NSX Manager then deploys a GigaView VM instance on all of the hosts within a software-defined data center. NSX Manager will also push monitoring policies you have defined in Fabric Manager. If you define a policy for a set of VMs as part of an application, then NSX Manager will include the traffic monitoring policy along with the new VMs as the capacity for that application expands within an application security group. NSX Manager deploys new VMs and topology as the application expands. NSX Manager applies the right traffic policies. And then, NSX automatically copies the traffic for the visibility platform so it can be sent to the monitoring tools using NetX features. All of this happens without any user intervention. As network owners take advantage of various forms of virtualization, such as the VMware NSX platform and the software-defined data center, the visibility platform is right there to ensure visibility for that traffic. The GigaSecure Security Delivery Platform supports both virtual and physical network architectures with a suite of features that extend access and visibility to traffic wherever it flows. These features are all readily accessed through Fabric Manager's console, or they can be a part of a traffic monitoring policy associated with any number of software abstraction and orchestration managers or directly from tools, all via the Gigamon API. For more information about GigaSecure, refer to the GigaSecure training module. GigaView VM also provides virtual traffic visibility in networks driven by Cisco application-centric infrastructures. Monitoring virtual traffic in a Cisco ACI infrastructure is similar to monitoring a VMware virtual environment and underlying infrastructure. In addition to what has already been presented for virtual traffic access, 
Cisco APIC inter-switch communications may be selected for monitoring or troubleshooting. And of course, there is also Gigamon support for tapping Cisco BiDi links. For cloud-based virtualization, where your workload is running as a tenant in some other network owner's virtual environment, there is support for OpenStack KVM, too. Lots of traffic access choices exist if you are the network owner. What if you are not the network owner and are instead using cloud services as a multi-tenant cloud client? In the cloud, a tenant is not permitted access to the infrastructure and could be residing immediately adjacent a competitor without knowing it. The tenant could be all on one host or distributed across multiple hosts, again with no knowledge of the underlying infrastructure. In that situation, the features designed to support OpenStack environments running on KVM hypervisors may be an excellent option. You still have a suite of tools for monitoring performance and security. Use a visibility platform for local, physical, and virtual network access within your own data center. Instantiate small GV tap applications into each of the workload VMs where monitoring is desired mirroring traffic for monitoring purposes. That is, add an access application to your own virtual machine instead of the cloud provider network. Leveraging a traffic visibility profile within Fabric Manager, have those GVT taps forward selected traffic to a GigaView VM virtual appliance, which is included as another server in your cloud deployment. GigaView VM performs aggregation and filtering before forwarding selected traffic out of the cloud and into the visibility platform inside your data center. Fabric Manager provides policy definition, orchestration, and traffic management, and can itself be automated through OpenStack or other orchestration and management platforms using the RESTful API. This access is obtained without awareness of or administrative access into the cloud provider's virtual network and without any assistance from the cloud provider. The first part of this presentation described how GigaView VM supports various virtual environments. The next part of the GigaView VM is management and configuration information. Under the Fabric Manager's left menu choice for virtual management, you are shown a list of deployed GigaView VM nodes by clicking on the Virtual Nodes tab. There are buttons for the tasks of Bulk Upgrade and for Bulk Deploy. If Deploy is selected, then a window opens where the various settings and configurations for one or more GigaView VM instances to be installed in selected hypervisors by Fabric Manager. To choose which hypervisor should receive an instance of GigaView VM to permit traffic monitoring, click the Select Hosts button. A Quick View window slides out. On the Quick View, mark the checkboxes for each hypervisor you wish to have Fabric Manager deploy a virtual node to. Then click OK at the top of the Quick View. A new Quick View window opens. On this Quick View, you enter the specific addressing and set any other configurations for each virtual node which will be deployed. Again, click OK at the top when ready. The Quick View closes, and if after reviewing the configurations you are ready to deploy, then click the Deploy button at the top right. Notice that Fabric Manager had almost all of the configuration elements available for you to choose. This is because Fabric Manager has inventoried the entire vCenter environment so that required data entry is minimized and often reduced to simple selection boxes. Other management tasks which are easily accessed through Fabric Manager include adding and managing connections to one or more vCenter servers, managing credentials for Cisco 1000V virtual switches, and managing or editing existing virtual traffic maps. Like the other management and configuration operations for GigaView VM, creating a new virtual traffic map is very easy. From the Virtual Map screen, click on the New button at the top right. Then simply go down the page making the configuration choices and configurations. Name the new map. Either select or create a tunnel destination to export the traffic to. Add a new rule for this mapping, typing in any required parameters to go along with the rule choice. Use the lists of all known virtual machines to choose one or more virtual NICs for this mapping to monitor. Then, review the map details and click Save when ready. A virtual map is that simple. Additional details about GigaView VM can be found in the GigaView VM installation and configuration module, in the training modules for Fabric Manager and GigaSecure, in the product brochures and data sheets for Fabric Manager and GigaView VM, in the GigaView FM web interface online help topics, and in the user guide. In this module, you have explored how Gigamon Private Cloud Solutions provides ready access into a variety of virtual environments. You are now able to explain how GigaView VM supports traffic visibility after virtualization, describe specific support capabilities for VMware ESXi, Describe additional support for VMware NSX and the software-defined data center. Explain support for virtualization within a Cisco application-centric infrastructure. 
illustrate the way in which GigaView VM provides traffic access in OpenStack or KVM environment when your VMs are present as a tenant. Detail the simplified deployment, management, and configuration of GigaView VM. This completes the training module describing virtual traffic access features and capabilities provided by GigaView VM. Thank you.